Those colonists sure do have some Zerg troubles. What do you think of Dr. Hansen? She's a lovely thing. Full of honey, that one. At least, that's what she wants you to think. You think she's hiding something? You ever wonder why the Zerg hit our world so fast? Something there they want. Something made of honey, maybe. Buzzing little bees. Never thought we'd be back on Meinhof again. Oh, we broke our backs trying to make a life on that rock. Kelmorian squeezing us dry. Day we rose up, we just couldn't take it anymore, you know? I feel ya. Man's got a duty to stand up and be counted sometimes. Oh, hell, we were stupid. Having right on your side ain't no match for goss guns and combat walkers. A lot of folks died for nothing. If you hadn't shown up when you did, Hey, your people bought their own freedom, paid for it in blood. Me and Matt, we were just glad to help. Sir, you should check out the research console. Well, Ariel, found a world for your people yet? Yes, an unclaimed planet called Haven. It's near the edge of Protoss space, but it seems safe enough. It'll have to do. Your people need to lay low for a while. Aren't either of you worried the colonists might be infested? How could you even suggest that? They're perfectly healthy. I hope so, Ariel. The Protoss don't mess around when it comes to infestation. Just in case. Maybe you should start looking into some kind of cure for the Zerg virus. Conventional wisdom says a cure is impossible. The virus mutates too fast. But I'll look into it. Just do what you can. That's all anyone's asking. Kerrigan's learning some new tricks. The infestation on Meinhof seemed particularly virulent. It's about the worst thing I can imagine. Losing who you are like that, all the while being slowly twisted into a damn monster. If any of Dr. Hansen's people on Haven are infested... I know. It's just a matter of time before the Protoss come looking for them. Still, I have a history with the Protoss. If it comes to that, maybe I can talk them down. Folsom is ripe for the taking, man. Every voice that we've received, re Mobius wants us to go after him. New Folsom is ripe for the taking, man. 
Every voice that was ever raised against Minsk is pinned up inside those walls. We let all them prisoners loose, and he'll never know what hit him. Just let me know when you're ready to pull the trigger. Where's Tosh? I thought he'd be here by now. He already left the ship. I thought you... Sir, we have an incoming transmission. It's highly encrypted. Patch it through. Well, well. The infamous Jim Rayner. My name is Nova. We should talk. Now what would one of Meg's pet ghosts have to say to me? Tosh is lying to you. Get Tosh on comms. I'm sure he's listening in anyway, encrypted or not. We Spectres be the future. You just couldn't handle it, little girl. Every ghost that became a Spectre has gone on a psychotic killing spree. The ones I've captured are held in New Folsom. Don't listen to her, brother. Help me bust the Spectres from New Folsom, and we'll bring down Minx together. Tosh wants to reactivate his Spectre buddies, using the substances you helped him collect. New Folsom is full of psychopathic killers. Do you really want to release them into the galaxy? I'd be helping you against Minsk. And my people will, too. She won't even join you. He's a psychotic time bomb. He'll be on your side, right up until he puts a knife in your back. This be the moment of truth. Make your choice. You should have told me what you were really planning, Tosh. But I'll take your word over Dominion Assassins any day. We've come this far together. May as well see it through. You've made a poor choice, Mr. Rayner. I knew I could count on you, brother. Now let's go and bust open New Folsom. Uploading New Folsom data now. Feast your eyes on this, brother. They're locked down tight. Nova must have tipped him off. We're gonna need an army to break into that place now. Even an army couldn't get you in there. But one man, one specter in the right place, can find a way in. Then our progress is all up to you, Tosh. I'll push my boys as hard as I can, but they're gonna need your help to gain ground. Sure, you sit back this time. I'll take the lead and clear the way. Just keep sending troops to keep the pressure on, and I'll do the rest. There are two cell blocks containing military prisoners outside the main compound. If we break those open, we could probably count on help from the inmates. What else? There's a Dominion base right by the main prison entrance. Take that out and the guards will retreat. The prisoners can handle it from there. All right, Tosh. You ready for this? I've been waiting a long time for this. I'm ready. Let's just see about that. a psionic explosion to take out groups of marines. That little trick I call Mind Blast. I do what I wanna do. Maybe yes, maybe no. Damn straight. Irie. Let's do this. I do what I want to do. I mean, that turret across the bridge. It can see me and alert its allies if I get too close, even with my stealth.
I do what I want to do. Yes. I know it before you see it. Tosh, my boys are moving in to back you up. Remember, just keep sending in troops, and I'll do the rest. on toward the front line. the first military cell block now. Releasing the prisoners might buy us some allies. I do what I want to do. Yes. Our allies' base is under attack. Our allies are being attacked.
Not enough energy. Let's focus. Let's just see. those prisoners will really help us out. while we establish our forward position. Let's do this. Damn street. You're close to the second military cell block, Tosh. Feel like making some new friends? Don't you worry about us, Tosh. We'll keep them busy while you free the prisoners. are free, we can bust this place wide open. Great job, Tosh. Tosh, we got a nuke ready for launch. Ain't a target. Just don't call the strike in too close. Thank <laughs> you. 
being attacked. Fifty years, no one's ever escaped from New Folsom. But we broke it open in an afternoon. I can hardly believe we pulled it off. You guys did good. Now me and my specters will finish the job. We'll kill Nix and burn his dominion to the ground. Overthrowing Manx is just the start. This is about building a better tomorrow. Don't you see? We just released every scientist, philosopher, and free thinker that ever challenged Manx's rule. That was our real victory today. You really that naive. Tomorrow there'll be a new Manx, and another one after that. Great shining dream of the future is just an illusion. So if it's all so bleak, why are you here, Tosh? What do you get out of all this? Same thing as you, brother. I don't quit till Minsk is dead. Vengeance doesn't factor into this. Our revolution's about freedom. You'll see that better future, Matt. But it ain't for the likes of us. Thank you. 